Hi, thank you for using JetBuilt. In this video, we'll give you a quick walkthrough of how to install and use our QuickBooks connector application. To start, you'll need to have a copy of the setup file. Go ahead and click on the setup file. All right, so this will bring us to our connector setup window. Let's click next, next again, and install. And once that's done setting up, we're going to click Finish, and you'll see that the Connector app has been added to your desktop. Now we don't want to open that up just yet. First we need to open up QuickBooks. Now let's open up our company file, and for this example I'll just use the sample file that QuickBooks provides. Let's make sure we're logged in as an admin, and then click OK. Now that we've got QuickBooks set up and ready to go, we're ready to open the Connector application. Let's double click on the JetBuilt logo here. And now that we've got the application open, the first thing we're going to want to do is go to Settings. And this is where we log into our JetBuilt account. And once you've done that, hit Login. And you'll see that we've successfully connected to JetBuilt. Now, before we close out this window, we first want to go to Income Account Mapping. And this will allow you to map JetBuilt's income fields to the ones that you've created in QuickBooks. Next, click OK, and we'll see that our data has been saved. Now that we've got the connector set up, the first thing we're going to want to do is import projects from JetBuilt into our QuickBooks account. Let's go ahead and click Load Projects, and we'll see our list of projects right here. For this example, I've created a QuickBooks test project in JetBuilt. Let's go ahead and select that, and then we're going to click Import Projects. We'll see the status is importing, and now it's done. Now you can open up QuickBooks to verify that the project has been imported. So let's go to our customer center. We can see that the test customer has been brought in. Now we also want to check the total of the estimate. We see $1,000 here. Let's also check jet built. And we can see that that is the original total as well. Now the last thing we want to do is export a customer from QuickBooks to jet built. So let's hit export customers. And I can see my list here. I'm going to export this first customer. Check that off and click Export. And we can see that it completed. So we're going to check in JetBuilt. Now we're going to search for our customer in the Clients section of JetBuilt. And I can see that this Daniels AV has been brought in. So that wraps it up for this tutorial. We hope you find the connector application very useful. And thanks once again for using JetBuilt.